The Ministry of Agriculture, Water and Forestry increased the levy from 0.95% to 5% on the import of maize, wheat and mahangu. Namib Mills is already in the process of importing the raw materials which are used to manufacture the products. So from our side we cannot um, not implement the price increase as it is an additional cost for us uh, and we cannot bear that additional uh, expense. So in the end we was actually forced in order to, to uh, increase the prices on all these commodities. As a result, the price on all locally produced pasta, maize, wheat and mahangu products will be 4% more expensive, effective as from the 13th of July. However, Namib Mills management have been and are still in talks with government to try and get the levy decreased at least for the rest of this year. We as millers are actually in favour of no increase on the levies. This increase in the raw material price due to this levy uh, is making us on an international basis uncompetitive. So in essence this is against the growth at home uh, policy that's currently being driven by the Ministry of uh, Trade and Industry or currently Ministry of Industrialization. So for that we, we still are in discussions uh, because in the end to, go, to grow the industry and to create additional uh, jobs in this country, we would like to export. Namibia currently exports maize meal and pasta to Angola. Pasta is also exported to Zambia and South Africa. The previous increase that was announced by Namib Mills was due to a drop in crop expectations as a result of the drought.